fear and greed. How do they play out on Wall Street? These are two powerful emotions that are believed to drive the financial markets. In this scenario, greed is when you want to oversatiate yourself with money more than necessary. Some even say that greed has the power to make us think and buy irrationally, almost like an addiction. Then there's fear. You're hesitant, stressed, and you definitely don't want to take risks. When this goes on, investors flock to safer assets like gold, treasuries, more stable opportunities. And while this sounds like a more logical way to go, it can hinder investors from making big bucks in the market. So we can be too fearful and too greedy, and we can take advantage of that. One way is to use the CNN Money Fear and Greed Index. This tracks indicators like volume, volatility, momentum, and a variety of product demand that's all weighed equally. Lower reads, fear, higher, greed. Right now, we're at a number 14 out of 100, indicating extreme fear. So if you want to channel your inner contrarian, you could use this to get ahead on the other side before the market realizes it is lopsided and corrects itself.